Today, I'll show you how to do your phantom crypto taxes. Hello, my name is Nelly and welcome back to another wallet integration video. Uh, today is another really easy one. We're talking about Phantom. So I'll talk a little bit about the wallet itself. Then I'll jump into the integration with Coinly, which is really straightforward. And then I'll show you how to get the necessary tax documentation. And then lastly, I'll leave you with some links down below. If you have any questions or if you'd like to reach us, um, we'd love to get back to you. But without further ado, let's jump into today's video. So the Phantom Foundation was founded in 2018 and it's based out of South Korea. Uh, Phantom has an impressive ecosystem that includes over 80 dApps, which are constantly growing with a lot of opportunities for new developers to get involved um, because they also have a incentive program. These dApps include everything from NFT platforms to wallets to lending, borrowing, yield optimizers. They even have their own coin, obviously the FTM, which is currently trading for close to to USD. Okay, so that was a quick introduction into Phantom itself. Um, a lot of you that are probably watching this video already know that, but that's okay. So let's jump into the integration. First, you're gonna sign into Coinly, um, head over to the wallet section, click on add wallet, and then we're gonna find it, Phantom, there it is, FTN. And you only need the public address or key, which is really easy to find on their platform. So we're here on their platform. This is the login page. Um, if you head over to wallet, and in the top right corner, there's a little um, icon right here. And if you hover over it, it'll say copy address. So that's what we want to do. And there you have it, address copy to clipboard. I would say warning, use this address to receive Opera uh, FTM only. If you're receiving FTM ERC20, you need to use a different address. Okay, so that's good. That's a good thing to keep in mind. Um, let's go back into Coinly, copy and paste import and that's pretty much it now obviously if you're using phantom with i don't know metamask or trust wallet or coinbase or whatever it is this is the same address you're looking for so i'll show you one more example of where it is on uh, metamask so um i've already ha actually made a few different um networks so i have the ethereum i have the phantom and i have the avalanche if you have if you haven't seen that video um i guess i can leave a link down below if you're interested in that one as well because a lot of people um use these two anyways um, once you set up your network for Phantom, the address is right here, right the, at the beginning. And same thing as before, you go back into Coinly, click it again, there it is, and import. So it's really straightforward, and I don't think you'll have any problems with importing um, information for this exchange, for this blockchain. And one small thing to note here, once that information is imported into Coinly, head over into your transactions and make sure to tag everything correctly. Make sure everything is tagged depending on obviously what you're doing, you know, if you're staking, make sure to tag your um, sent to pool and sent from pool stuff. Um, so that's very important. Make sure your, your tags are correct. Okay, so that was pretty straightforward. I like to think one of the easiest videos we've probably had on this channel. Um, the best part of all now is how easily you can get your um, necessary tax documentation. So head over to tax reports. Here you'll get a summary of your transactions, your capital gains, your expenses, your income. And this is a great area just to keep track of your crypto activity throughout the year to see where your taxes are going to end up. And then at the very bottom, you're going to select you're gonna select a tax plan that is appropriate for your needs. And now on the screen before you are some various tax plans that we have. So for the US, we have the IRS Schedule D Form 8949. You can also export to TurboTax both online and desktop versions. For the UK, we have the HMRC Capital Gain Summary. We have reports for Sweden, Norway, France, Switzerland, Australia, and then lastly, Canada, Germany, and other countries, we have the complete tax report. And just keep in mind, the complete tax report is also a document you can give directly to an accountant and they can submit that file with you know your other tax documentation or alternatively you can invite them to coinly to set up their accountancy firm here with us um, and then lastly what i tell everyone is to make sure to check your country's rules and regulations because this plan this report might actually be deductible and that brings us to a conclusion of yet another integration video um, some links now down below if you need uh, further assistance so we have the coinly help center where you can find countless crypto tax related articles to learn more about that um, topic obviously uh, we have a feedback section if you have any bugs if you have any suggestions things like that you can leave that down here in the feedback area we have a forum section where you can talk to members of our community as well as our staff and then lastly we have a contact se section where you can send us a message directly and we'd be happy to help you but if you found this video helpful in any way consider dropping a like subscribe for more crypto content and i'll see you next time peace